And today, the top two teams in the Southeastern Conference will square up for supremacy in the SEC. The Kentucky Wildcats hosting the Arkansas Razorbacks, game three of a three-game set. Top Ar five prospect. And tried to change speeds again, but four-pitch walk, back-to-back. -back. This is marvelous today. There was the good changeup. And a great way to end the inning if you're Mason Moore in the Razorback strand two. And Mason Molina, the junior from Rancho Santa Margarita, California, transferred in from Texas Tech. Where last year he was all Big 12 second team, made the, again, the 0-2. Change speeds and it worked. Hammered. High and deep. Diggs goes back. It's out of here. How do you like that, Mom and Dad? <laughs> Tried to get another high fastball by him, it looked like. It. See, he told us yesterday he's starting to see the ball a little bit better, which is scary. 2-2. Two -two. Big hop for Grant Smith. And just gets Peyton Holt Saturday. Ten runs for the Razorbacks as White draws a two-out walk. Luther, Oklahoma native, looking to bunt his way on. Devin Burks fielding. Got him. And easy. 2-2. No. Two -two. McCoy goes the other way with a pitch that probably would have been ball three, but guarded the plate. Now the Wildcats with their second base hit. Hit hard, but there's Peyton Holt. And there are two outs, and that's one of those at-bats where you do everything right. Goes off speed and runs it in on him. Good pitch by Molina. Stovall says, I'll take it, and he does. Wildcats put a man aboard, but he remains right there, and it's one nothing. Four-pitch walk. Evan Burks finds his way on again. That's hit Reaches pretty good. out and crushes it. And that is gone. That wasn't even his best swing. Well, it looked like he was way out in front of that ball. But when it went off the bat, it jumped. With almost like you'd hit a flyer and you're playing golf and you get one, it just jumps on you and you're not expecting. But he reached out and that one really sounded good. Season. Reached out on a fastball. Peyton Stovall takes care of business, but Wildcats put up two more. We'll talk with the teams. Oops. Oh. We're bragging on him, and he hits Kendall Diggs. Yep. But a lot of teams. One out. Now a four-pitch walk. Wow. Fourth walk delivered by Moore. Grant Smith, Petrie, Nicholson. That's two. 6-4-3 gets it done for the Wildcats. New pitcher for Arkansas, now a right-hander. So the Kentucky switch hitters will step across. But Nolan McCarthy greets him with a shot to the alley. Good speed for McCarthy. He'll take a look, and he'll stop at second with a leadoff double. First pitch swing, and he'll move the runner. There's one out man on third. Man. He could tell you what you had for lunch. <laughs> a big hop. And they got him. Not a great bunt. Now McCarthy immediately says review it. He oh, might have he, beaten there. that. He's there. I yeah. believe he's there. He beats it. Yeah, it looks. There's that left hand. hand. Yeah, it looks like he beats the play. Whoa. To give Grant Smith an RBI. There's Walt Schmidt transferred in from College of Charleston, and he dumps one down the line. They're going to hold Grant Smith and Walt Schmidt with a double. It went about 150 feet, and he's actually a Charleston Southern transfer. And he made a good pitch. He did. That's hit pretty good. He three drives it. That'll chase a run home at least, and off the glove of Peyton Holt. Another break for the Wildcats. And 
Burks tags one. What a grab in center field. Boy, if that's a, they call it a catch? Wow. Tremendous play by Peyton Holt. He immediately redeems himself. Look, he gets that glove under it. Ball goes in. Outstanding catch. And Burks with a sack fly makes it 6 0. That's the new arm for Arkansas. Christian Fouch, Littleton, Colorado native, will try to come in and slow these Wildcats. McLaughlin eats it up. And that'll do it. But Kentucky putting on the pressure. Okay. Oh, yeah. 2-2. Two -two. Off the handle. Daly scoops it up. Wow. Safe. Oh. Hustling down the line. The catcher, Hudson White. Whoops. I know. Oh. Put that in your pocket. Mason Moore. Tried to throw him out, but it does. Or base hit. Uh -oh. Now the Hevo Loy, and he'll dump one in the right field. Windmill is on at third base. And the Razorbacks are on the board. They answer after giving up six straight. Playing with fire all day. Speaking of, second man, he's plunked today, and bases are loaded. 2 1. Into the bat, McCoy in right field. He's got a good arm. But not good enough to keep Stovall from scoring. And it's a 6-2 game. A run for an out. Ryder. Wow. Got the outer edge. 2-1 pitch. High and deep. Left center. And Peyton Holt hangs on to this one. You can't get it much farther. Not a bad piece of hitting for McCarthy to go the other way and fight it off. Come on. Pull the string on it. So the Wildcats threaten. They leave a man in scoring position. Inside out, there's Emilian Petrie. Positioned perfectly, and there's one out. Oh, just past the <laughs> mitt of that, Hogan. That one went in at 94 and came back out at about 104. <laughs> Blew that one right by him. And Hogan again stalks off the mound. Drafted in the 20th round, Mr. Flynn, by your Cincinnati Reds. Mm -hmm. Today when he came in. And Waldschmidt gets under it. This time it's Kendall Diggs and right. Two out. Arkansas put up two in the fifth. Petrie rolls over on it. McLaughlin, another clean pickup. And a good inning. Hit hard into the alley. That's going to find the wall. Peyton Stovall with a leadoff double for Arkansas. The Razorback. 3-1. And he's walked him. Turn out with two out runners at the corners. Back up the middle. Trouble. Petrie's got it. But it drives in a run. And the Razorbacks are still alive. First pitch swinging. That's McCoy in right. And that'll do it. That's the definition of putting the fire out. But. Arkansas with another run. It's 6-3 Kentucky on the SEC. Yes, he does. And Lopez dumps it into center field for a oh. base hit. Good play by Holt. That ball almost took a big hop over his head. Sends it right back up the middle. Lopez on the move. Misplayed by Holt. They're going to send him. Good job by Nick Mingione that time. Once he saw the misplay, he never hesitated sending him. And Lopez never quit running. And now at first base. Backhand by Alloy is going to make the long throw, and he gets McCarthy. Should have Fort Worth in Dallas. Sky high. 
Waldschmidt back and now in. Two out. 2-2 Two -two pitch. Got the inner edge. First strike out for O'Brien, and it comes at a good time. James McCoy is going to try to beat this one out, but Peyton Stovall beats him. That is crushed to right field, but Diggs is there on the track and hauls it in with two steps to spare. Wildcats go down in order. We'll go to the ninth. Max got their first base hit in the fifth inning. Uh-oh. Got under that one. Uh-oh. McCoy escorts it out of the yard, and Arkansas breaks back with another run here in the ninth inning. And it's 7-4. The Razorbacks will not go away. Boy, is he a good player. Breaking ball, gets that foot down. Boy, goes down and gets it. Wasn't much doubt. This ball cleared defense a bunch. Kentucky defensive alignment straight away in the outfield. Oh. That hit him. Wow. Now they're at first and second with one out. Got under it. McCarthy in center. Two out. First pitch swinging. That's deep to right, but there's McCoy. And the Wildcats close out Arkansas. They take two out of three with a 7-4 victory. Kentucky now 18 conference victories all alone atop the Southeastern Conference. Two really good ball clubs that are going to make a lot of noise as go to the NCAA.